stress so the topic of the decade whether you are a ug aspirant or a pg aspirant or even upsc aspirant anything the one thing which everybody is going through is so called as depression or otherwise stress according to hans sailey who just coined the term uh, stress it is actually non specific response of the body to any demand for change actually it's a bit difficult to understand to put it in simple words from an aspirant point of view as uh, our ms dhoni said thinking about the result will actually land up in so called stress actually it is true we are thinking about the results what if if the question paper is tough what if if we don't go through the exams what if if we suddenly got fainted in the exams what if if totally blanked in the exam so these are all the actual results which we are thinking and this produces a negative response which causes a stress followed by depression so this is an important task that every aspirant should overcome in order to see their actual potential so here are some few ways by which actually i overcome my stress to produce my success so those who are new to my channel welcome to my channel inspiring brains this is hari completed physiotherapy currently doing third year mbbs and an an academy educator so the ways by which you can overcome your depression maybe so called stress first is forget about the results so it's always the results right so what i personally do is the two ways one is a positive way and there is a negative way whenever i have a thought about the result i'll just think in a positive way like what if if i produces an r rank all india rank or what if if the r rank uh, goes viral and uh, every youtube channel or news channel newspaper everybody comes to take uh, some responses from me and i'll be uh, going through all the channels like so it's a good positive way and the ne- second process is negative thought so even i personally uh, have some negative thoughts what if the question paper is totally tough or what if if we don't go through the exam so when i have such thoughts in less than 10 seconds i'll try to distract myself whether i'll make a call to my friends or talk to the parents or uh, just see some uh, motivational video anything but try to distract so only two ways one is positive way think in very 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 much positive way because that will gives you immense strength i'll just uh, store all the immense strength to focus on my studies to bring on the actual results second is distract the negative thoughts that's the easiest way so that you can forget the results second is focus second technique is so called focus actually according to me every uh, this exams these examinations or like chess game so you have to focus each and every square to get your success if you fail in one such square then it may leads to your failure right so examinations are like that you should make your focus in such a way that you should not have a small distraction even for for uh, thinking about the results so this is a very important point focus focus like a pro third refresh see always the start and end of the day should be pleasant so that uh, it will increase the energy for the rest of the day start your day with meditation as it will energize your soul increase your focus and decreases your distractions and gives you much more things to study for the rest of the day and in your day with a small walk maybe on your rooftop or along the streets get some good air positive vibes and increased energy for the next day this is a very important thing to end and start the day thereby you are uh, making a complete plan for yourself for your preparation the final thing is plan the important thing is whenever we start the day we are must much confused in uh, what to study right so whenever if i wake up at 5 o'clock or 4 o'clock or 6 o'clock anything the first one hour i'll just spent in selecting what are the things i have to study this is a waste of time utterly waste of time because the morning is very important because you can do anything which you once thought you cannot so that's very important time and i'm just spending the time in just a selection making so the important technique is plan the day before itself the things which you want to be finished by tomorrow has to be planned today so at the end of the day 
just write the things what and all you want to be finished by tomorrow in a piece of paper and just paste it on your wall or just keep it uh, along with your notes and in the morning once you wake up do all the necessary things and just take the paper and start your work don't again spend the time in selection process because it may again lead to a wastage of time and that may result in stress and that may result in depression and again the depression makes you to think again and this vicious circle is going to continue all the way and if you want to break that plan accordingly that's a very important point right so these are all the four important points by which actually i overcome my depression as well as the stress in order to shine in my exams both on um, entrance as well as normal university exams i just want to thank all the subscribers for actually supporting me for my first vlog and i am uh, sure that i'll make more vlogs like this and if you want any topics to be uh, dealt by me just put it in the comment box below so that i'll talk in the next video thank you